Hi guys, welcome to the Java class. In today's session, you will learn the copy constructor concept in the Java programming language. So you can see this program we have done in the previous session. That is the constructor overloading that part we have done. So if you have not watched this video, please watch it first. Then it will be easy to understand the new concept that is copy constructor. So let us first let me create a new package. And I will just change it. That is a copy constructor. I will remove this package. Okay, so this package is not present. So, how to fix it? We can move this class inside the package. It's copy constructor that will create automatically. You can see the copy constructor is created automatically. This is a package. Inside it, we have a class car, right? It has some field. It has no argument constructor that we have used in the previous example, so it is not required here. I will just remove it. This is a constructor that is taking two parameters. It is not also required. I will just remove this part also. So I will use this constructor that contains the three parameters. That is a model, and that is a year, and that is a, is electric, right? So this is the method which will display the information. And this is the example. So I will remove everything here from this. And this is the example. So let me just show you what is this. This is a class car, right? You can see this class car contains three different instance variable. One parameterized constructor and one method will display all the values. Now this is your main drive class. Inside it, you are creating an object. And you are just saying this is a electric car and you are displaying it so let us just save it and we'll run this program and you will see the output of it so here you can see the what is the output it is showing this is a tesla model year is 2019 and is it a this is a electric car right so now what is copy constructor so as the name suggests copy constructor is used to copy the data of one object into another object of the same class of the same type so again i'm just repeating it copy constructor is a constructor that is used to copy the data of one object into the another object of the same class so sometimes there is a need to create the multiple copies so how will you do it so this is the object you have created. For example, you would like to create a copy of this object. So how will you create it? For example, you would like to create a copy car. So how will you create it? Let me just create a new object that is copied. Car, right? Is equal new car. So how will you create it? So to make the copy of this electric car, simple concept is just you will use this object and you will pass inside it okay this is to make a copy of it right so i will just make it right creating a copy of existing electric car right so i am trying to make a copy of an existing electric car so how will you make a copy of it right so it is very easy you will just pass this object as a parameter inside this constructor this is the electric car so when this is the way to copy it right so whenever you will write this object inside this constructor so compiler will start complaining what is the complaint here? The constructor car car is undefined. Definitely, it will just just show the complaint because whenever you are creating the object of this electric car here, you are passing three parameters and it is calling this constructor, right? But right now you are passing an object that is electric car into this constructor. So this constructor is not present here. So you have to add one more constructor inside the car that will help you to copy the data. So how will you do it? You can do it manually also, or you can fix this 
error one quick fix available create constructor car car so let me just do it manually so you will be able to understand it let me just add one more constructor so i will write here the copy constructor so i will add here the copy constructor so i will write here the car okay so inside it what will i write i will write here the car another car here right so this i have created now you can understand what is it just focus on this part this is very important so now the compiler is not complaining here you can see you have created a copied car and you have passed the object of electric car because you would like to make a copy of electric car that's why you have passed this object so previously it was making a complaint means this constructor is not defined so right now you have defined a constructor here that containing the object of a class object of a class so you must know about it whenever you are just calling this electric car right you are creating this electric car so what it is doing right what it is doing you can see this value tesla model is coming to here this 2019 is coming to y and this 2 is coming to this here right so whenever you will pass some object so you must have a compatible constructor that value will be received of in the same type so here the object you are passing so this value will be received on the same type in the object of the class so now the electric car data will be copied into an object of another car and here you will just extract it right and you will write the model is equal another car dot model and your data will be copied your year is equal another car dot year right and here you will write is electric is equal another car dot is electric so here you can see so how it is working you can understand the process of it how it is working so let me just try to help you to understand how it is working so this electric data right now this you know this electric car contains three different values this and this and you are passing this electric here so it contains the three values and these three values will be copied inside another car here and how will you access it another car contains the three different values that is model year and electric so how will you access it another car dot model that value will copied in the model another car dot year that will be copied into year another car dot is electric will be copied into the is electric so this is the way to copy the data of one object into the another object so here now you will just call the function that is copied car dot display information right copied car dot display information and here you will display electric car dot display information and whenever you will run this program you will see your exact data is copied into both the objects so this is your electric car data first one this is the copied car data so this is about your copy constructor so i hope you understand this copy constructor part so like again I, I will show you the concept that is a class car it contains some variables this is the constructor this is copy constructor you have added right and this is a method which will display the values and this is the your driver class so i hope you understand the concept of copy constructor thanks for watching the videos bye bye for now we'll see you in the next class have a great day